Hey guys, the Kid Bit here, and today I have an unboxing from Efforts.com. So I'm not actually sure what is in this package. I'm not 100% sure. I have, I have an idea of what it is, but it could be multiple things because I have multiple things coming from Efforts. If I had to guess, it's probably in the title of this video. Actually, if I had to guess, it's the green jade cube ghost cube. Yes, that is. I hope I'm not just being colorblind, and I'm pretty sure that is green. Also, because the other metallic ones I ordered in the set of four. So this is the limited edition green ghost cube. If I can open this up, I will have it in my collection. Okay, so this is actually my first metallic one. It came before the set of four, and this looks really nice. Okay, so this is what the green metallic ghost cube from Jade Club looks like next to the uh, standard ghost cube. This is the handmade one. This is the mass-produced black stickers on white plastic. And this one turns very nicely. I lubed it with some Maru lube and no other lube. And this turns just like this without any lube. So maybe it's just like the metallic ones that are good out of the box. But the other ones were kind of stiff. I'm really excited to scramble this. So ghost cubes actually happen to be my favorite type of puzzle, second to 3x3 shape mods. I guess it is a 3x3 shape mod, but just ghost cubes are my favorite type of 3x3 shape mod, which happens to be my favorite type of puzzle. So this is my first metallic one. It looks really nice. Let's take out a piece, how they fit together, if I could find it. Alright, so this is how they fit together. It's like standard pieces. I think there's a cap here, yeah. There's caps on the inside of the pieces. That little piece right there. And then for those of you guys that don't know, a ghost cube is just a standard 3x3 shape mod. There's the core, standard core. Actually it looks a little like looks like there's a little ball in there. Let's get it to focus. So I just want to say in my opinion, I think the handmade ghost cube turns this it's the most smooth ghost cube in my whole entire collection. Really glad I have that. Won't really be talking about that. I have a review on that. If you guys want to check that out, I don't have a review on the mass-produced Ghost Cube yet, but I will have a separate review for the metal ones. Well, actually, I might just do all of them in one. But the metal ones seem to be a little bit better out of the box. I might just mention that in the actual in-depth review. But let's just do a scramble on this and then compare it to a scramble on the standard. And also, this one doesn't appear to be signed. I think only uh, they're signed only if you get the set of four. But here's where this looks scrambled. I like how the light reflects off of it. And then this scrambled. So here are what the two puzzles look like scrambled side by side. This is the green one. And this is the white and black one, obviously. But these are really fun to solve. I recommend everyone out there gets a ghost cube and tries it out. It really kind of confuses you at first, but then eventually you get used to it. One tip is start with the sides that have uh, these centers with three big sides. So I will have a review out for all of these hopefully soon and I apologize for not having that many videos out lately but I'm graduating June 9th from high school. I'm done. I've had my last class, my last finals tomorrow, Wednesday, but you guys probably will see this Wednesday or Thursday. I'm not quite sure when I'm doing this but I'll definitely have this out before June 9th. But after June 9th I have a graduation party on the 14th and that's, I guess that's not important, but I will have lots of videos this summer. I leave for college, I think August 21st, and one big question is uh, whether I will be uploading videos or not during college, and you guys will have to wait for the Q&A to figure out about that, and I didn't forget about the Q&A, it was a long time ago, but a long time ago when I asked you guys for questions, but I will have that video out as soon as I graduate from high school. So anyways... Hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing from Mefferts.com or the Jade Club, but from Mefferts. And they have this while, uh, while supplies last, so I recommend you guys go out and try and find this, find the Jade Club invite code. Anyways, go get yourself a ghost key from Mefferts.com or HK Now Store. They both sell them. I think they're around 60, uh, $36. And you can get a set of four for like 115 ish. Alright, so I hope you guys all enjoyed this unboxing from Mefferts.com. If you have any questions, feedback, or suggestions on how to improve my videos, please let me know in the comments below. Please leave a like and read the description for the Letter World winners. This video's letters are G-H-Z. Read the description if you are confused about what these letters are for. 
This counts the coupons can be found in the description as well. I hope you all enjoyed, and thanks for watching. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn.